Well, welcome patrons. Hey, you know, this is our very first patron with our new videographer, who mm -hmm. is Blue, right back there behind the camera. And we're so excited because right now, this is the grand opening of a brand new Ed Steely exhibit. This is a fabulous exhibit that's in Springdale, the Shiloh Museum. And we're gonna sing a song that it's a tribute to Ed Steely. Uh, it's got an interesting story. I'm holding a very special instrument that I saw on the internet. And I thought, who in the world made this instrument? And so I emailed the person and I said, how did you know Ed Stilley? This is beautiful. I could tell it was a tribute to Ed Stilley. I mean, and uh, he said, well, you know, actually I've never been to America. I just saw a picture on the internet. I live in Belgium. And it turned out this man named Kurt Tumote had made this beautiful tribute just on having seen a photograph of an instrument. So, you know, we, uh, a couple years went by and Donna decided that she was going to try to get by for me for Christmas. So she sneaked a little email to Kurt, and he wrote her back, and, and uh, he said, you know what, I really can't sell that, but I'll give it to you. And that's kind of what happened. So it, that turned into a song. By the way, uh, Kurt, living in Belgium, we told that uh, to Ed Stilley, of course, and he, he calls Kurt uh, the, the man across the water. <laughs> man across the water. That's the name of the song. It is. Two, three, four. <laughs> There's a man over in Belgium who makes his guitar out of all sorts of odds and ends and boxes from cigars. But he never can sell them. They're too close to his heart. That man across the water that he found on the internet one life-changing day Was a photo of it still in the an angel that he made And he read its story And it moved him so deeply That man across the water Made a fine tribute to Ed With a resonator made from an old cake pan And he wanted to share it With someone who'd understand That man across the water Well, of course, we're the ones who understand And this is the email that Kurt sent me. Dear Donna, when I read your email and told it to my girlfriend, she was looking at me with big eyes and she said, oh my, this must be a very hard decision for you. And it is. When I built my first guitar, it kind of felt like therapy. Maybe like Ed felt when he built his guitars. And when people ask me, what are you gonna do with all these guitars, sell them? I answer, no. For me, the emotional value is too big to pay with money. Maybe one day I give them to people who understand this value. So I decided to give the Stilly tribute to Kelly, you, and Ed, because it feels like the story behind the instrument goes further in an emotional way. I'm happy to see that this guitar travels his or her own way to the other side of the water. One last time, and recalled how to make it, it had eased his worried mind. Then he sealed up the box, and he sent it on its way. Arkansas.
song from the band across the water. as good a harp as I've heard. That's really a nice harp on that one. Oh, that's beautiful. Yep.